Hi guys, I'm back with another video and first I'm going to start off by saying I apologize for any background noise you may hear the bubble guppies because my little two year old son is watching the bubble guppies. So anyways, um, I'm coming to you to show you guys how to do a three strand twist out. Now this is my first time doing a, a three strand twist out that I'm doing right now on camera and I've already done my first one and this is what it looks like as you can see um, right now I'm noticing that I'm not getting as much shrinkage as I would with a regular two strand twist out so I'm liking that but right now I'm just going to show you guys how to do a three strand twist out and then I'll show you guys tomorrow how the results came out so and like I said, this is my first time. But first, let me give you guys background. First, I washed and I shampoo washed and conditioned my hair. And then I only did this side with the um, deep treatment mask. This is my, I'm using this as a leave-in conditioner. And for my twist out, I'm using the Motions Naturally You Motions Hydrate My Curls Pudding as a curl definer and then the define my curls cream right after it and if you guys don't know I have a video on both of these products letting you guys know how I like them but um yeah here goes nothing and as you can see my uh, parts are not small at all so I'm just gonna pull hair from random sections like I said my hair is already detangled and I have in my leave-in conditioner and now I'm just going to use the Hydrate My Curls Pudding to base my hair. And I am going to have to zoom in the camera so you guys can see. And now I'm using the Define My Curls Cream to set it. And as you guys can see, this does start to define my curls and my hair very well, very pretty. All right, so let me zoom in. Excuse my hand, guys. Okay. So, the first thing you wanna do is start off by getting three pieces of hair. And like you're going to start braiding. So I have my three pieces of hair. And then you actually do start braiding. I'm going to start braiding maybe like form the braid. One, two, three, four. I do like four braids. And now I'm going to, or I, maybe I did five. But anyways, it doesn't matter. Braid your hair, braid the root first. And then you're going to take the three strands of hair, and this is my right, on the right side, you're just going to flip this hair over both of the two strands. So, it's going to go on this side, now move the hair in place, and repeat it again, the right side, flipping over. Repeat it again, the right side flipping over. Right side flipping over. And you guys, that's it. That's what you do the whole time. Flip the right side over. That's the only piece of hair that's being flipped over and moved in a three strand twist out. Everything else is just sliding over to be flipped over on the right side. So just flip over, flip over, flip over. And as you guys can see, this is very time consuming, so it's going to take a lot longer than a two strand twist out. And even, it even takes longer than regular braiding your hair because you guys aren't, you know, you're not used to this motion. I know I'm not. So it's taking me a little bit longer. So have some time on your hand to do this. But yeah, you're just flipping over the right side. And my hair keeps getting mixed up into one another. That's the annoying part. 
But yeah, this is all you do the whole time. I hope you guys can see it good. Flip it over the right side. Take the right piece, flip over. Flip over. Flip over. It kind of reminds me of braiding in a sense. My pieces keep getting mixed up. But yeah, guys, I don't want to bore you. So I am not going to show you um, how I do my whole head, but it's going to be the same just like this. But yeah, just flip over the right side. My battery is low, so yeah, that sucks. Alright, I'm almost to the end. And obviously, if you have shorter hair, this won't take as long. And if you have longer hair, it's going to take even longer. So, yeah. Um, I'm getting closer to the end and I'm just going to stop right here because I want to show you guys before my battery ends. What I do is take some more of my pudding or whatever hair cream you're using and I just curl the ends so it can have a uniform curl at the bottom. And there you go guys. That's how you do the three strand twist outs. Very simple but it's very time consuming. Alright, so, and as you guys can see, this has shrunken up, so it does not stretch that much. My hair has shrunken up a little bit. So, yeah, you guys, um, I will be back to show you how my whole head looks three strands twisted. And, yeah. So, when I finish twisting the rest of my head, I'll come back and show you guys. Okay, guys, I'm back and I finally finished my whole head. And this is what it looks like. Um, as you can see, I did it a little bit bigger in the back of my head because, you know, it took me forever to do the top of my head, these small ones. So I did like six, I think. Yeah, six big ones in the back of my head and called it a night with that because, you know, it was just taking me so long. But anyways... I Sorry about that, my camera went out. But like I was saying, I just did bigger twists in the back because it was taking me a very long time in the front. Now, um, I did a two strand twist, I believe this is it, yeah, right here to compare how a two strand twist looks compared to a three strand twist. And you can kind of see a difference. The two strand twist is not as tight. You can see there's a lot more, you can see there's something different with this one. So, I wanted to compare how the twists look when they come out. I mean, I hope that there's a bigger difference in the twist because it takes a very long time for me, at least, to do the three strand twist. So, I'm hoping that um, I like how it turns out and that it comes out really defined and like a different type of wave or curl comes out. So, yeah. And that's pretty much it. I guess I'll see you guys in the morning to take down my twist and show you guys how it looks. So, good night, everyone. Oh, and before I go to bed, I'm going to show you how I'm going to wear my hair to bed. Basically, I'm just going to use a scarf and pull my twist back a little bit to tie down my edges so they can be smoother. So, yeah, that's it. All right, good night. See you guys. Hey, you guys, I'm back. And it is the next day, and as you guys can see, my three strand twists have shrunken. They are no longer elongated like they were last night when I did them. And I just wanted to show you guys the difference once again. Here is the two strand twist out I did, and a regular three strand twist out. So you can see there is a difference in how the twists look. And there will probably be a difference in how they look when I take them down. 
So now that's taken down and I'm only going to be using this coconut oil and that's it. Here it goes. A little too much. Okay, so I believe all my twists are out. And, oh, Lord Jesus, I got one more step back here. So, make sure you have all your twists taken out. But as you guys can see, um, it kind of looks like a regular twist out, but I will show you guys up close because, you know, I did that one strand that was a two-strand twist out. And, you know, my whole head was a three-strand. So, this is the two strand twist out results and just compare that to the rest of my head there is a slight slight difference in the texture it looks as if the three strand twist it has like it has a different wave sort of it just I don't know I can't really tell what the difference is it has a different wave. It has more of a tighter wave. It looks a little bit more defined than a... See? It's a different curl. That's all that is. This is a perfect example of what a three-strand twist out looks like. I love how that looks. It's very pretty. So, um, since I've taken it all out, you can see that it's pretty flat right now. And I'm going to separate it a little bit more. And I'm going to use this comb. I love this comb, especially for detangling. But anyways, I'm going to use this comb to um, fluff up my roots and give myself some volume. So... really defined and flat. I mean, I like defined hair, but I also like it to have a little bit of volume. So the next day is always great for me. But here are my results, and I must say that I love them. I love them. It takes a really long time to do the three strands with that. At least it was for me. But, you know, it's really great results. My hair is very moisturized, bouncy. It looks really good, and I love this. So I'll show you guys the back of my head. I hope you can't see my part. At least I tried to stop it. So I would say that um, it has the same amount of shrinkage as a regular two strand twist out. But it's definitely a different curl pattern or texture. And I really like it. So yeah, that was my three strand twist tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed it and could follow my tutorial and understood it. And if you guys have tried the three strand twist tutorial, how do you guys like it? 
Just leave your comments below and don't forget to subscribe if you'd like to see more videos from me. Bye.